Fresh from the showcase here at Swiss Watch Expo, we're talking about Valentine's Day in the color pink. The color pink evokes a bit of an aristocracy type uh, feeling. It's a very passionate color, but it's also very lightweight in its feel. We're gonna talk about some of the pink watches that we have in our inventory right now, and we do have quite a few. Mother of Pearl being the very most popular color in pink. Mother of Pearl comes in pink tones naturally. Most mother of pearl colors are artificially colored. In other words, they are dyed, they're bleached white, and then dyed to another color later on through the process. Or maybe they're even painted on the backside when they have sort of a clear iridescent color. So pink is a natural color, and it's very difficult to find in really deep, specific tones. So when you find mother of pearl, it's kind of special. And these watches that we have here are also special. One of the ones that I wanted to start with because it does have the mother of pearl dial and it's extraordinarily rare. And in fact, to be clear, I've never actually seen it. And this is the Tag Heuer Golf Watch. It was actually a Tiger Woods watch. And what's really interesting about this watch is not only does it have the pink um, strap on it, and it even says Tag Heuer, it also has the pink mother of pearl dial, which is really brilliant. It's very light, but it's very brilliant. Now, the interesting thing about how this watch is worn, if you look at it, it sort of looks like it has a band and it looks like it's a stretchy kind of thing. It's actually not. It is adjustable underneath the watch and it also comes apart almost like a transformer. So I'm gonna push the two buttons at the top and you can see that the watch splays out. Now, that's how you put the watch on and when you clasp it back, you just simply fold it over and snap it back down. So it's a really interestingly made watch. It's something that's absolutely exclusive to Tag Heuer. You can adjust this band to fit your wrist perfectly. Now, one of the things about this watch is, is that it's super lightweight. It's made of titanium. So the shell of the watch is extremely lightweight, aluminum and titanium. And then it's a quartz watch, so it's battery powered. It's not mechanical. So it's absolutely impervious to all the shocks and all the things that might happen when you're playing golf. People don't realize that there's a lot of force that goes up through your arm when swinging a golf club, and there's harmonic uh, vibrations that will knock mechanical watches off once they receive some sort of shock, even in the lightest form that you may not physically feel, but the watch actually sees. So that's kind of an interesting thing. Now. Let's move on to another watch here in the category, which I actually find to be one of my favorites. This is an interesting watch from the standpoint that it has a lot of iridescence to it. So not only does the watch dial have iridescence to it, so does the pink strap. This is an Omega DeVille. It's also a chronograph. Now, this particular watch is a sport watch. It's a little bit thicker on the sides and if you like a, a watch that is not too big, but also has a, a good presence, this is definitely a great watch. Now, this happens to be an automatic watch. It winds itself, it's mechanical. And I'm gonna show, see if I can show this a little bit. It's got the case back where you can see the internals of the actual watch itself. It's actually a beautifully designed watch. Once again, it has the pink mother of pearl. Now. Of one of the interesting features on this watch is that it has the date up in the top, what you will see as the top left-hand corner of the dial. Now it's a chronograph, so it has quite a lot going on. It has the date up in the top left-hand corner, which is something very unusual. Usually that date is either at the three o'clock position or in between four and five down at the bottom. I find this to be really cool because it sort of looks a lot like a moon phase watch from some of the German manufacturers, as a matter of fact. Uh, if you've ever seen Glasuta uh, or even Alain Gazon, they will put dates and other things in the top left-hand corner of the dial. And a lot of times the moon phase is up there as well. So it's got a very interesting and unique profile, but the color pink on this is absolutely extraordinary because the iridescence of the strap, the alligator strap, matches the iridescence of the mother of pearl dial. I just think that this is absolutely a wonderful piece. Now, the reason we're talking about pink for Valentine's Day is because obviously red is the most dominant color evoking passion and that type of thing. P 
Pink is obviously a color version variation of red. Pink has a sordid history. In the early days of pink, it was a universal color. Uh, men and women both wore it. It became, in the 1800s, sort of a controversial color. It was used to identify clothes for males or females, boys or girls, because fashion sort of evolves over time. We've sort of progressed past that now, and pink has also uh, sort of become another universal color. But I think when you talk about pink in just these types of watches, for ladies, for Valentine's Day, it's a very soft color. It is a passionate color. It's also very universal. So the color, believe it or not, will match a lot of different variations, blues and blacks and also grays. So there's a lot of mix and match things that you can do. Pink is one of the most rare colors that you'll find. Emerald, I'm sorry, um, uh, tourmaline or pink diamonds, pink diamonds being the rarest of them. They're very, very expensive. So pink is a hard color to come by. It's very highly sought after, and it's a very good dash of color if you just want something simple and subtle that can both be casual and dressy. This particular watch is our Rolex, mother of pearl dial in pink with a diamond bezel and the diamond numbers. Absolutely gorgeous. Now this watch is also white gold. So it also has the very light pink strap to match that very light pink mother of pearl that's in the dial. This one also has the deployment clasp. So it makes it easy to wear. It's absolutely gorgeous. This watch is 100% flawless. It is the very highest mirror polish on that white gold and that beautiful pink dial with that diamond bezel is just to die for. So you have some very high-end sort of evoking the aristocracy style uh, of color here. The final one is a very light dash. It is not mother of pearl, but it's a very light dash of pink on this Cartier Ballon Blue. Now it also has a metal deployant clasp, metal bracelet. This one's a stainless steel. We also have these in other colors as well. There's a lot of different colors in our inventory, variations of pink, whether that's very, very bright or very, very light. There's also different color combinations, different strap styles, as you can see the ones that I've displayed here. This is a great color for Valentine's Day. If you don't wanna get something shockingly red that might be even more controversial, this is a nice light touch of color. It's very easy to wear and it's very rare in the watch world. So if you wanna get something special for Valentine's Day, these are some great choices. If you have any questions, call us here at Swiss Watch Expo, email us, or pick out a stock number and message us through our website. We'll be happy to answer your questions. If you have any other questions or concerns, you can also leave them through the YouTube video as well. We check there. Subscribe, like, click the bell on YouTube, and we appreciate it. Have a great Valentine's Day.